new game and I'm gonna play some Wolf Among Us. Yay! So I've already played. Oh, see, okay, yeah. So I've already played the first two episodes, but I want to put the others up, so that's why I. What is this? No, I don't want to play my chapters. Duh, hello. Anyways, so I want to uh, play the other episodes, so that's why I am doing this. Issues, okay. I guess, yeah, save file too. But yeah, I want to do the other, the other, the other episodes. So I'm just trying to get this up on my channel. Like, it's this game series that adapts the choices you make. The story is tailored by how you play. Yep, that's Telltale. I hear they're coming out with a uh, uh, Game of Thrones. Once a time in a New York City, there lived a community of fairy tale characters known as Fable Town. Fables who lived there arrived hundreds of years ago after they were exiled from their homelands. Through the use of a magic spell called Glamour, they have to protect their secret community from the mundane world. Sheriff Big B Wolf protects them from each other. I am Sheriff Big B Wolf. Again, if you missed it, a uh, record for the date. Hottest ever in June. Uh, 103 now, and that humidity looks low. But remember, the hotter the air is, the more moisture it can hold. So 103 with 31% humidity is a lot more humid than, say, 73 with 31% humidity. And it is muggy out there. <laughs> Mr. Toad? Oh, shit! <laughs> Big B! Listen, mate, I, I know I don't look human. It's a problem, I get it. I just stepped out the apartment for just a second to see what kind of damage this drunk shit is doing. Just cut me a break, yeah? I'll get me glamour first thing in the morning. Cross my arm. No need to kick up a fuss. I've heard enough of your excuses, Toad. This is unacceptable. If you can't afford to look human, you're going to the farm. It's as simple as that. You can't send me up to live with those animals. You know what I mean. Go see a witch. Get a glamour. Big B, they're bleeding me dry, mate. The quality of the spell goes down, but the rates keep climbing up. Do you have any idea how much it costs to have an entire family in glamour? I don't make the rules. Sorry. I can't give you a free pass on this, Toad. My hands are tied. Right. Right. There's too much at stake. Whatever it costs, it's worth it. You don't want me catching you out of glamour again. Fuck you now! See? This is what I told you about, Sheriff. You're just gonna stand there? Do something, Big B. Before he completely tears up the place! So... What am I walking into, exactly? A woodsman's on another bender. He's been going on like that for hours. Turn this place to dust if you let him. He's in a fucking rage. <laughs> this is the last straw, Big B. He has to go. Fine. I'm heading up. Get your glamour. Deal with the woodsman. Furry prick dub shite. Tell me how to spend my money. Dad, the lights are shaking again. What did I say? You want a big bad wolf to take you away? No. Then get the fuck back inside. Well then, nice to his kid. 
Okay. So. Now we got to see the woodsman. You're gonna know who I fucking am, you hear me? Hey! Look Matchbook. at me! Matchbook. Stop, okay? You're drunk! I'll take that. The, uh, that is annoying. What is that book? Take a look. Take a good look. I guess I can't have it. All know right. who I am now? Uh, I'll knock first. Just open the door. <laughs> God damn you! No way! Whoa, 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 hey, hey! You've got something on your face. Fuck are you talking about, you stupid c <laughs> <laughs> I'll fucking kill you! <laughs> Alright, what's going on? Ow. What are you gonna fucking do, huh? Get the fuck out of the way before you get the axe again. You're drunk, all right? Think this through. If you keep on like this, I won't have any choice but to put you down. Put me down? No. Oh. You got a shit fucking memory, Wolf. That's not how it went last time. This isn't last time. Challenge. To the bookshelf. Back off, asshole. Oh, he's got a lamp. Ah! Ah! Hit it. In the knee. Ah! Uh -huh. To the sink. Oh, that was a good idea. Ha ha! Ha ha! You can't hit me! You can't hit me! Uh. Ow! My goodness! For punishment? Fuck you! To the the bed thingy. <laughs> Punching. Punching like. Oh. Jeez. Uh. Get up. Oh, God. Ah! I almost pressed the wrong button. A Q. Q. Ah! Uh. Hey! Uh. First time I did this, I died. <laughs> you should probably get out of here. Look, I'm not leaving until I get what's mine. You're not getting shit, bitch. I'll fucking put you on the ground. Hey, if you can't be nice, I'm gonna make you wait outside. Oh, fucking shit. You bogged my jaw, you bastard. And still you talk. Fuck. You. Shit. What the hell is going on? What happened? A little misunderstanding that turned into a real shit show. Don't worry, you saw the best bits. There's more where that came from, girly. Knock it off! Look, this is just the start of a shitty night for me. I just need the money he owes me, then I can go. Are you alright? I'm hunky-dory. Thanks for asking. What's your name? Whatever you'd like it to be, handsome. Don't make this more difficult than it has to be. Sorry, Sheriff. Wouldn't want to add any difficulty to your night. Why was he hitting you? He asked me if I recognized him, knew who he was. I said I didn't. He started beating on me. Then you showed up, started beating on him. That about cover it, hon? I'm the woodsman, you whore. I saved Little Red Riding Hood from this monster. I cut this fucker open and filled his belly full of stones. 
and threw him in the fucking river. That's who the fuck I am, you stupid bitch! Uh, would you excuse me for a moment? By all means. Come on! <laughs> oh, jeez. How? <laughs> Fall out of a window. It. Oh, poor Toad. Hey, Toad. My car. Yeah. <clears throat> Give me a second. Oh, no, by all means. Take your time. Make yourself comfortable. <sighs> Sorry about the car. We ended up going out the window. It couldn't be avoided. I can't be mad at you. I called you, and you come to help. I can't be made. But even when you help, things end up more fucked than they started. Well, at least you're not fucking dead. Thanks. Don't mention it. I'm just getting what he owes me. You all right back there? I mean, your eyes and the teeth. You're not really supposed to do that, are you? Not if I can avoid it. Great. The guy's got an axe in his brain. He's not feeling that. It's more from me. He'll be fine. I'll kill you, you fucking bitch. Let me help you. <laughs> He's had enough. He's a fable. Son of a bitch can take plenty. <laughs> 